Okay, we've had Polly just a week now, just over a week. Uh, she's done really good. She has uh, only pooped once in the chalet. Um, she's had a couple of little wee wee accidents and stuff, but nothing, nothing too much of a drama. Um, she's coping with the lead really well. She seems to be good with recognition, especially with you know a mum and me. Um, if she sees one of us, she's, she runs up to greet you and stuff like that. We've taken her in the van when we've been shopping and apart from a little bit of yelping at the beginning she's settled down very quickly. So um, what we've done is we've kept her happy with little toys to keep her going and um, behaviour wise as well, she's, although she's playful she is learning, you know, she's learning a discipline as well which is really good so um, yeah have a little look at her while she's playing and see what you think. Well, Polly, this is the van. What do you think? Hmm? Hmm? <laughs> this will be your holiday then. Doggy. Hey, what do you think? Hmm? What do you think of it? Hmm? A little camper van? Hmm? Yes. <laughs> Oi. Uh, uh no. Not for wrecking. Come on. Good girl. Come on then. Hello. Is that it for now? <laughs> She's proper relaxed, isn't she? Mm. Little dreaming feet. Mm. Not even a response for the pheasant. Or oh, a little <laughs> foot tap there. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Polly. <laughs> hey. hey. Good girl. Time to get up, baby. Diddle's time. Hey. Um, no. <laughs> Bugger off. Leave me alone. <coughs> mm -hmm. A bit better. Not impressed. Hey. Yeah, little lead trotting doggy. Yes, you're doing very well, aren't you? Hmm. Eh? Tell him. Hmm. Oh, there. Hmm. Good girl. Little film star, aren't you? Eh? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> it's 
이제 밥좀 줄자. You think a camper van in then gog? Does it suit? Yes, she says. It does. She says, and I like the idea of a log burner in winter. <laughs> do you do, don't you? Hmm? Well, I'll let you go in. This gully pog comes out. <laughs> Say bye bye. Hmm? Gog diaries. Good girl. Aren't you? Good girl. What's this? We've set out the first uh, three steps we will take to carefully modify the measures. We're actually using the lockdown to begin to allow people to return to their way of life. But crucially, avoiding a second peak that could overwhelm the National Health Service. You're all filmed, dog. You're supposed to be enjoying it. Come on. <laughs> so much choice. There she is. There she goes. Good try and film you. <laughs> no, it doesn't want you licking it. It doesn't need you chewing. Oh, undercarriage check. Hey. Little madam. Oops, down she goes. Ah, no, no, no. Good girl. Uh, evil eye. <laughs> what is it? Yeah? Where are you going? Hmm? Google. <laughs> oh shit, I didn't press record. Again. I keep doing that. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Gog. Well done. Get ready and we go. Polly's trying out harness and a little stretch onto the beach. Come on, Polly. Come on, Bobby. Fire on the sand or? See what she makes of that. Oh, 
<laughs> That's a hit, isn't it? She's, she's going to pick up shells and bits and all sorts, you know. So it's middle of the road, mm -hmm. and it's to do with a lone fisherman, and he comes in, gets lost in a fog, I think that says. Proves impossible to navigate. The worst is yet to come when his encounter with a seemingly abandoned sailboat becomes a fad. A seemingly? Yeah. And this, I think, is another docudrama. <coughs> oh. The Haunting of Emma James. Yeah. <laughs> In this new period documentary, we take a fresh look at the un... unveiled? Unveiled Master of. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
enjoys the drinks. <clears throat> so how long we had in there? A week. Mm. A week and a day. A week and a day. So there we are, Polly Poppets. She's certainly starting to feel at home, isn't she? Mm.